people who are depressed usually are not getting enough oxygena oxygenated um, blood to the brain. So when you deepen the breath and you're taking more breath into the lungs, you're getting more oxygen to the brain. So that's one thing. You're also uh, stimulating the vagus nerve, which is a known treatment for depression. Um, many of the breathing practices that we do stimulate the vagus nerve. You're raising GABA levels, um, which is, uh, in the, when GABA levels are low, um, it is an indication of anxiety, depression, post-traumatic stress disorder. You're lowering cortisol levels, the fight or flight hormone, the stress hormone. So there are a number of you know, physiological reasons, but I think what you're also doing for people is you're giving uh, them moments, a window through whatever mood state is there. So they may come in with depression, they may come in with worry, they may become, come in consumed with their own story. And in the moments where you lead a pranayama, or they practice a pranayama, and then sit and notice the sensations in their hands, their fingers, the palms of their hands, the face, they are present. The body is always present. The mind is a time traveler. It can go to the story, it can go to the mood, but when you can cue to sensations in the body, and that's what yoga does, it brings us directly into the present moment of sensation. And that, for people who have been burdened by a mood disorder, or burdened, carry their story so heavily on their shoulders, those moments on the mat or on the cushion when they have that clear space, those moments are enough to say, there's something more than my story. I have this story, I have this loss, I have this trauma, but I'm more than that. I have this, this diagnosis, this belief about myself or the world, but I am so much more than that. And yoga gives us access to those, that, that, who we really are. I was going to say other realms. It's not other realms. It is, I mean, and you can look at the seven realms and the you know, celestial realm and all of that, but it's really depth of self, knowing who we are beneath the mood.